so now I'm going for a run I run for about I don't remember how many years usually I run only in warm season it starts from May all summer then maybe till October when cold winds start but this year I think maybe I should try to run in winter also so usually I run for three kilometers it's also uh, alongside the little river uh, which we have here and um, yeah it's about 30 minutes and it's enough for me just to maintain the the strength in my legs in my body so this is my late breakfast this is eggs with uh, milk like omelette omelette from eggs milk and broccoli mushrooms somewhere there is a red fish and salt pepper i think that's all yeah and this red one is an sauce sweetened chili sauce for spring rolls lately it's my favorite sauce and also i have um, tomatoes with salt and pepper and also this plate for my son who is playing fortnite at this moment and can't uh, stop it hello nikita <laughs> Nikita, do you understand me? <laughs> Nikita is learning English for four years right now. And I'm afraid he doesn't understand me right now. Say it in English, please. And turn off your phone. Say hello to my English auditory. What are you saying? I don't understand you. And by the way, he goes to the language school and learns English there for a year. He already done it, but he still doesn't understand me. <laughs> you shame? <laughs> no, he doesn't. <laughs> I'm going to talk with you on English every day. How about that? <laughs> no. No. Okay. you know. By the way, he's 13 years old. He looks like much older. 14, 14. 13, I said so. He looks much older just because his father is a basketball player and he himself is a basketball player. So he's very tall and looks like he's already 19. But he's not. He's only 13 and will come to the seventh grade. <laughs> He's so confused because he doesn't understand what I'm saying. But I hope that will give him motivation to learn better. Okay, so right now I'm going to manicure. I want to renew my very, very old manicure and um, make something very simple, very neutral. And then after that I'm going to my, or not my, our dacha it's my mom's place dacha is thing like garden or vegetable garden where when you where you can grow the food like greens potatoes cabbages and all the stuff berries everything you want maybe flowers uh, and in our country a lot of people have dacha I think in UK they call it allotment or well, something like that. But so we have a quite simple dacha. We grow food there, we have banya there where we can you know have banya banya is like it's like sauna uh, but a Russian style. Right now I'm going to take strawberries because we have two um, strawberry beds and it's the very very season right now um, and berries need to be taken from I'm going to take some time for myself there because now I'm going there without my children without my mom but 
by myself and of course I can be alone and for the mother of three children it's a very precious time it can be a very precious time so yeah I hoping that I will have a good time there so I redone my manicure uh, this time I made it very neutral with just a little touch of gold well right now I'm on my dacha I came here I already changed into my bathing suit because right now it's very hot and I'm going to wear this hat <laughs> not very glamorous but very effective with the symbol of our republic some kind of bird so let me show you our dacha sorry here I am this is a little banya where we also have a little room where we can change, sit, have a rest and you know eat or maybe wait for rain to stop sometimes and then all of this is our uh, land where we grow very different types of food here we have flowers which are without any flowers <laughs> still only here we have this is also flowers I don't know how will they will be in English but they are all very beautiful here we have cucumbers and I need to open them up because I need to water them first year we trying to grow cucumbers and we don't have our glass house little cucumbers you can see yeah there we have zucchinis which are growing quite nice here's a big one and here are also different ones then this is my attempt to grow um, artichoke or artichoke I'm not sure how it grows. Well, I have two. One second. This is radish. This is rugula. And that's rugula too. This mint, some kind of mint. There's pea, peas, the whole peas, and it's some kind of flower. Uh, and the salads. I love salads. I eat them all summer long. This one have grown up, grow, grown out. Yeah, I can't eat it anymore. And I'm afraid this one too. I don't know how to make it. This was some kind of mix. And I'm not sure how I should make it uh, to be not that... It's not tasty anymore. Here is my spinach which I'm also loving a lot and there is another kind of salad broccoli broccoli someone ate my broccoli I think it was also a first time experience maybe this one will um, leave and grow into real broccoli I don't know we'll see uh, this is and onions and these are all potatoes this one and there also but it is the here we have flowers which need to be you know freed from the grass <laughs> and also strawberries we have there with see oh my god it tastes so good real strawberry that tomorrow I have to come here early and just to lay on the grass and have a sun uh, sun bath I don't know how to say it. yeah but it's so good here so can you hear the birds singing I can hear from it yeah usually we are here with all our family my mom my kids my brother 
my husband sometimes when he's here but right now I'm all alone and we don't even have any neighbors so it's like so peaceful the, the perfect place for meditation yoga or filming YouTube videos by the way <laughs> Yeah, by the way, I wanted to tell you that you can ask me any questions you want in the comment section below and of course I'll try to answer. That's my GoPro somewhere. Yeah, I'll try to answer them as full as I can. <laughs>